got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We're about to get into Carmen Exposed by Corey after video. I don't know. Let's get it. Nick shocked the internet after she posts and delete a video of herself pregnant. Everyone was hitting me up, asking me, did I know about this? Why didn't I report on this? Hold on. I think this is fake and for a video. And I think that's why she deleted the video because a lot of people in the comments thought this was real and it's not. First of all, her and Kiana have been having a good time drinking, going clubbing. So I doubt if she's pregnant. And plus, Nick and Dwayne are not even together. She said it on a TikTok live that they're not together. So this is all for a video. Y'all leave y'all comments down below. Let me know what y'all thinking when it comes to that. Last night, Kaisen at LA Man where he's doing his 30 day subathon got swatted. I reported in my previous video that Kaisen had actually confirmed he's staying next to Diddy's LA mansion. Kaisen had oh, this thing about the police coming as well. Y'all called the boys. Y'all called the cops, okay? Knowing that it's already some weird shit going on in this neighborhood because you know my neighbor is. <laughs> you got that crib over there. And you know what they went on there and found up. So. Like, so, so when y'all internet niggas do that shit, and like, all the shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> DDG called Kaisenet out on stream. I told me some when Halo was born, he said that he's he wanna be the godfather. I don't know if he thought I forgot or something, but when I pull up, I told Halo this yesterday. When I pull up, I'm expecting at minimum diapers, <laughs> milk. You know what I'm saying? Like the nigga been when you when you're a godparent, that's what this come with, literally. The dead be godfather. Halo hasn't received anything from his godfather since he's been on Earth. So I don't want, I don't need nothing. But Halo feels some type of way about this. I told him the first time he came out, he want to be your god daddy. So I'm trying to make sure you straight with it. He was like, hell yeah, nigga, it's good. So uh, he just been waiting, and he asked me yesterday because I told him I was like Kai doing his subathon. He wants you to pull up. And he was like, he damn near didn't want to pull up. And then I told him, I'm like, maybe he gonna step up, you know? <laughs> maybe he gonna be a good godfather, you know? He is streaming in a $55 million house. Maybe he gonna step up this time. Maybe he gonna show um, that he really- Like a DDG is a character, bro. Care about you. And, and Halo was honestly sad about it. So I don't know. He said he had still come though. So we just gonna see how it go. Carmen dropped the video the other day speaking on her recent drama with Corey. Corey filing a CPS case against her. Also, Corey popping up at her house recently. Now, she did do a sit down video, which Corey did respond because he's wondering why she's responding to everything else but not signing the divorce papers. Now, before I get into Corey's response to Carmen, Corey did talk about the picture with the assistant and saying that she's the best girl that stepped foot into his life since June 20th, 2023. When it comes down to my twin, I don't play about him. Straight up. Anytime a woman is doing something for him and sucking his that's how you feel. <laughs> but that's something that y'all would never understand. You know what I'm saying? Twin came into my life when all the Fugages started happening in June last year. Was it July? June? No, June. And she's been in my life since then. She's never left. I know y'all be trying to assume, but you know, this is something that's private that I really we never we never put our show on social media. I don't have to. But that's like it's like this the this the realest female, you know what I'm saying? The that came into my life. I love her to death. And you know, go stay like that. And what's understood don't gotta be explained on that end, you know what I'm saying? Everybody the internet talk about so uh oh, every time he break up somebody, she come back. Never left. <laughs> it's like there ain't no coming. Every time he break up somebody, she come back. Never left. <laughs> it's like there ain't no coming back. When you never left. He only saying that because you she just gave that. Um, some, him because some see, sleep. Thanks. I respect the fact that she see what a young and going through, so she let me get all the love the way. But uh, 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 avoid that right quick. Who is, huh? Who is it that you want to be with? Genuinely speaking, no pride. <laughs> I'm asking. All right, y'all. We already reacted to all of that. So we're going to keep it moving to her next video. Definitely don't want to watch that again. The Taylor girls are currently in Houston filming content with Jazz, BJ TV, Kiana J, and Neek, and people have a problem with Ty Taylor leaving her daughter so soon. Y'all, I just got, I cannot believe. Not y'all minding her baby business. <laughs> literally, me, Daisha, and Carmen was literally talking about this. Was that yesterday? Or was it the day before yesterday? About when we be out enjoying ourselves and having fun, 
and people be like, go get your kid, your kid, where your baby at? Like, what? Like, <laughs> am I not allowed to have a life outside of my bundle of joy? Do I have to sit in the house just with my baby all day, every day, and don't do anything at all? Hell no. What type of planet is, th what type of life is that? Women were brought here to be like such a man, girl, police. You said you never get those comments. I don't. Surprisingly, I don't. I don't, I don't think anyone has ever stooped that low to even try to fix their mouth to say. Because I'm like you said, I'm normally with my kids. So when I do pop out, they be encouraging me to pop out. They be like, "Oh, girl, you deserve it. like all that shit I was doing." People can't so handle when that's a father at home. I swear. Or a grandmother or grandparents. You know, they hate them grandparents. But, oh, they was hyped. Oh, they was hyping. Girl, they in my comments. Where your baby at? Oh, no, they was, oh, no, they was hyping me up. I guess because I don't post when I'm with her like that. So they think I don't have my, but I have her all day, every day. So, yeah, that's pretty happy. This is like my first, like, break for real. And if I do get, like, a little break from her, it's only for, like, couple hours not nothing too crazy i ain't never this is my first time spending a day like a whole full 24 hours away from her so much your business bitch. hello clock dead i will like, say what, on that note people gotta stop i just be wondering like what 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 is y'all purpose in coming in that like are y'all trying to make us feel like we're bad parents or like like, what are y'all trying to get at when y'all come in? Why you ain't got your kid? Oh, you about to pull up the edit now. <laughs> what you think they be trying to accomplish when they say that? Oh, girl, they just be wanting to talk. They just want to chit chat. You know, some people just want to chat. They just want to get a response. And I think a lot of the times they just want to get a response. Because they want you to get mad. and they want. Because it's like. Oh, my God. You asking where the kid is at. Oh, Not I with you. Not That's with all you. I'm saying. Not with any help that you paid to help me. No, I'm saying. <laughs> no, she's trying to eat me down. She's trying to say, she trying to say, maybe because you literally like why people come in and why you ain't got your baby. Oh, because you just had your baby. Yeah. Oh, okay. Clock that. Clock that. What's <laughs> what you got to say? All right. So, we're going to do. <laughs> 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 the store, do you guys want anything? I'm at the In-N-Out Burger. Do you guys want anything? Please, girl. I, I I forgot what it's called, but give me the burger. Okay, I need I need everything on there, but give me them fries. I forgot what the fries was called, the voodoo fries or the uh, the jungle fries, whatever. Give me the fries. I need the fries. God, I need the fries. When I tell y'all if I live there, that will be a weekly thing. I'm going to in and out. Okay. Oh, God. Oh. <laughs> Big back, I know. Carmen is currently in Miami with Big Boogie for his birthday. I think people were assuming that they broke up because Carmen wasn't at Big Boogie's birthday party over the weekend and Big Boogie ex-girlfriend was, which people were very shocked because why wasn't Carmen at the party, but the ex-girlfriend was. Now, in my previous video, I said that Carmen might understand the situation and be cool with it. Y'all know Carmen don't look like she working because she has to. It looked like she's being kept by Big Boogie. He's paying the bills. You know, she's doing her thing, but he's mainly doing the main stuff. And in order to continue you to be kept she has to understand what's going on i'm not saying that's what it is but that's what it's giving because we're the only people tripping when a girl come about she ain't saying nothing sis is quiet playing her role in the house with her get her bills paid get her new car so if she I mean, she really got cheated on throughout her entire marriage how can you care about a nigga who you ain't even married to at that point it wouldn't even matter tripping i ain't tripping either y'all leave my comments down below let me know what y'all thinking when it comes to that 11 11 and jet so much bro i'm gonna marry that girl bro dead ass i'm going to i'm going to my, my, my words 
I'm sorry, she got on here, but I'm going to marry that girl, bro. I don't want to get no more relationship. My mom ain't get no more relationship till I do that. They're my dog. They're my, they're my dog, man. A girl that go, a, a girl that go uh, push you. A girl that go, you know what I'm saying? Like, they go match your energy spiritually. You know what I mean? Curious. Ain't with all that internet. She don't want to be on the internet. She ain't trying to be, you know what I'm saying? Yeah! What you got? Oh, yeah, we outside. What they talking about? I don't want none of that. I'm going to leave my free workout. I'm already hype. I'll, I'll get me. Dub's girlfriend was called out for flirting with Jay Seiko. He's so annoying, Jay. And Aries, TT's boyfriend, in a recent stream. Now, when the girlfriend first started coming around, she was quiet, she was low key. But now that she's opening up and talking more, people don't like it. They're saying that she's being way too friendly with the guys. Now, all that means, like, what? No, uh, what did she say? That she's being way too friendly with the guys. Now, all that means, like, what? No, uh, all that like it they're saying that she's being way too friendly with the guys now, all that like what? No, uh, mm. as his arms look like he can squeeze the breath out of your ass <laughs> we see you looking you was trying to tell him that you noticed his big body mm. Mm hmm Okay. We see you. Up here. Yeah, walk up here, Jaden. Oh, what am I doing? Yeah, walk up here. I'm gonna be more active in that one. Scary. Nah, 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 nah. He's over there falling out the chair. Nah, I, I don't like being blindfolded. <laughs> who are you? Who are you? You touched your leg. I don't know. I don't know what the hell happened. There. When you got a nigga, you don't keep talking to other niggas in the group. You got one or two look. Okay. You doing too much, huh? Mm -mm. She flirting? She flirting? Did she no, put the shark? Oh, no, no. no did she fuck stop, with the shark? All right, lay out, baby. No, hell no. All right, lay out, baby. She's fucking with the shark. No, no, no. That's not that. That's not that. Bad. That's not that. Bad. No, stop, stop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my bad, my bad, my bad. Yeah, all right, chat, all right, chat. <laughs> yeah, my ass. So just imagine, like, she go with Dub. Dub. And is around Jay Cinco, um, PT boyfriend, uh, Aries, and DDG. <laughs> I feel like she played her role just good enough to get in the door. You know what I'm saying? To look at all that, uh, to look at all the caramel in the building. Not that she does not like chocolate. It's just, well, I think she's in the season for salted caramel and not um, chocolate. That's what it's giving me. Hmm. Clueless. You don't be around too much like that. Never, Wait, stuff. never in my life. Never. Y'all yeah. yeah, comment down below. Was she being a little bit too flirtatious? Because even the cameraman was picking up on some things because he was like, Wait, hold on. Is she flirty? So I don't know if that's her personality and who she is. Maybe she's a very friendly person and it comes off a certain Since type. you better sit your ass on the corner and talk to the women in the house for you be booted out. <laughs> that's not, <laughs> that's not the group to get booted from, okay? Dub may be dub, but he'll take care of you, okay? He'll take care of you, your bill, your kid, everything, I'm sure. Better get together away but people don't like it dub's girlfriend did speak out she said reach a real hard and completely wrong find somebody else to play with please well here's what chris sales had to say about it i will definitely link his channel down below definitely go watch clock it with chris and ddg spoke out as well well y'all knew she don't like jc y'all know i mean y'all know that dub girlfriend don't really like him right come on now it, it, stevie wonder can see that 
on my soul. You know for a fact that she with that for money. And it'd be better if she just say it, because I feel like, okay. But, like, y'all know that. Bro, she, bro, his girlfriend will f any But, bro, hit, bro, I guarantee you, if you put any famous money, his girlfriend is getting cracked open. You worried about this and dub girl getting cracked by air? What? What y'all talking about? Look at the comments. 17 minutes. Dub gonna wake up and see the comments and be sick. Shoot is your girls give off flirty vibes, whether it's intentional or not intentional. Had to hit the gym, young dog. She feeling strong, dog. Give me the good news. You don't know how to listen? <laughs> Cause he said big. Did she just say you don't know how to listen? No, uh, uh, give me the good news. You don't know how to listen. <laughs> you don't know how to listen. No, all that big body for what? No, uh, no. All that big body for what? And you don't know how to listen? A strong dog. Give me the good news. You don't know how to listen. <laughs> What does his body have to do with his ears? Hold on, let me take these glasses off so I can hear what she just said. You know what I'm saying? Like, what are we? Because <laughs> uh, he said big body? I don't know, man. Maybe y'all, I don't know. I know y'all be weird with my brother anyway. Y'all always be trying to make it seem like, yeah, I don't know. I think y'all just reaching like y'all always do. Was that it? Is that what y'all being about? If anything, Aries in the wrong. I told TT about Aries two, three years ago. Aries the one in the wrong. And I tell TT all the time she need to leave Aries. Like, why do you got a tank top on? You do not have to have a tank top on. I tell him all the time, bro. Put a full length shirt on. TDG is such a hater. He's such a hater. Unnecessary. We get it. You work out. whoop de doo No one cares. He hate on his arms. <laughs> y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. Do y'all think she was being too flirty? Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.